10 Ways Our Universe Could Destroy Us. But first, we'd like to thank our fans for the great comments recently, especially this one in our Secrets of Our Founding Fathers video. We hope you enjoy learning about our vast, mysterious universe that could easily destroy us. Number 10. Solar Flare A solar flare occurs when a high-intensity eruption happens on the sun, and intense radiation gets spewed out, almost like a giant fireball heading towards Earth. Thousands of charged electrons and protons arrive to our planet. These occurrences would easily disrupt our electromagnetic fields. Modern human life is so dependent on electricity, so imagine a massive power outage across the entire world. People at first would think nothing of it, until weeks go by. A mass panic would strike the globe. The charged particles will shut down our satellites, making GPS completely useless. Modern society would crumble as we know it. Since a large amount of our currency is basically just a bunch of numbers in a computer, and very little is owned as cash, people would instantly become broke. Most of our food that requires refrigeration would rot, aircraft would fall from the sky, and power plants would simply explode. Some believe that this was the reason for the Tunguska event, when a large amount of trees in Siberia mysteriously were flattened. A solar flare that could have caused this mayhem almost struck Earth in 2012 and missed our orbit by only two weeks, so watch out. Number 9. Supernova Explosion A supernova is an astronomical event that happens during the final stages of a massive star's life. What basically happens is a catastrophic and dramatic explosion, and you can bet this would certainly cause the end of the world as we know it. For a short period of time, it appears as though a new star is being formed, but it quickly fades away. Many supernovae explosions do happen, but we're lucky to be far away enough to not be affected. But some supernovae could be close enough to destroy our ozone layer and send catastrophic levels of radiation into our atmosphere. The levels of radiation would be so high that you would basically be able to look through each other and see a person's bones due to the high amounts of X-rays and gamma rays that are given off. And there's a star that's called Betelgeuse that is near the end of its life. It's also been acting kind of strange lately. Number 8. Asteroid Impact we keep hearing how catastrophic an asteroid hitting Earth would be, and this should certainly not be taken lightly. The effects of a giant rock wouldn't just destroy the area it crashed into, but it would have a global catastrophic impact on the entire world. Even a smaller asteroid would leave us with giant tsunamis that could devastate coastal cities. A giant asteroid would basically rip a hole through our atmosphere. Imagine looking up to our sky during a perfectly sunny day and seeing the stars through a hole. A medium-sized meteor would usher in a nuclear winter where cities around the world are experiencing snowfall at devastating levels. It would no longer be safe to live on the surface of the Earth. Mankind would have to resort to living underground, and possibly we would have to evolve to be some type of mole-like creatures, eat anything we can get our hands on, feasting on rats, spiders, and possums. People who survived would simply be survivors. Life quality would be nothing like we're used to. Would we even want to live this way? Number 7. Gamma Ray Burst you might be familiar with gamma rays from the comic book character The Hulk, who was exposed to them apparently. But in reality, nothing can survive direct exposure to a gamma ray. A gamma ray burst is the most deadly of any kind of known explosion in the universe. And some believe it triggered an extinction of life 450 million years ago on this planet. It certainly has the capability to happen again. Some scientists believe that these happen when a black hole is formed by certain supernovas or when stars in our universe collide. Gamma rays have the highest frequency of any wavelength on the electromagnetic spectrum. If a gamma ray burst were to hit us head on, it would essentially set the entire Earth on fire. The amounts of radiation they give off would simply destroy the entire ozone layer, even if it just grazes us. Luckily, the likelihood of this happening is pretty low, because we would have to be in the direct path of the beam. But essentially, they have the power needed to destroy life on this planet. Number 6. Rogue Stars A rogue star is an actual shooting star, and are also known as intergalactic stars. These stars do not stay within one galaxy and can travel throughout our universe. They're mainly caused from two galaxies colliding. The Hubble telescope first discovered one of these in 1997 and has brought up a lot of debates. So what would happen if one of these rogue stars were to travel through our solar system? We're relying on the sun to give us life and due to our perfect distance from it, it makes it suitable to inhabit Earth but it could possibly bring on the worst apocalypse scenario imaginable. The rogue star would completely throw off our gravitational orbit and cause us to slowly be sucked into the sun by its gravitational pull. Each day would slowly become hotter and hotter. Heat waves would strike the earth and cause severe weather storms. Ice caps would melt at unprecedented rates. Power outages would be inevitable due to everyone overusing their air conditioning. Blood would begin to boil until it was too late, and every living thing on this planet dies out. Metal structures like the Statue of Liberty would simply melt from high temperatures. Eventually, the entire earth as we know it is sucked into the sun and explodes. Number 5. A Black Hole 
A black hole is a place in our universe that pulls so much gravity that even light cannot escape it, according to NASA. The matter has been squeezed into a tiny place, causing an intense gravitational pull. Some scientists think that the smallest black holes could be about the size of an atom, but actually possess the mass of a mountain. The largest black holes are literally called supermassive and have the masses of over one million times the sun. So is there a possibility this thing could destroy us? NASA seems to think not, or at least not in our solar system. But recently, in 2016, astronomers found this black hole devouring everything that came into contact from 200 million light years away. That's still pretty far, but they could certainly be more common than we once thought. So what would it be like if this happened in our galaxy to our beloved Earth? The strong gravitational pull would first send off enormous meteor showers that would each have the similar devastation to atomic bombs showering our planet. The moon would eventually explode from this, and we'd be able to see it from Earth. Eventually, we'd be sucked into the giant black hole, but some are a little unsure of whether or not it will cause complete destruction of our planet. Others think it could possibly bring us into a parallel universe. Number 4. Alien Invasion While this might seem a tad crazy, the universe is a vast, mysterious place, and alien life could be out there. Theoretical physicist, cosmologist, and author Stephen Hawking, possibly the smartest man on the planet. If aliens were to visit us, it would be similar to Christopher Columbus landing on American soil. And we all know that didn't go too well for the Native Americans. This guy is seriously frightened by extraterrestrial life. Homo sapiens have only existed on Earth for about 200,000 years. So what if some civilization or species from another planet has even been around for just 100,000 years more than us? What could that species be capable of doing to our planet? Stephen Hawking also claims that we really should just mind our own business if we come into contact with alien life, since they would most likely be here to colonize and enslave us than trying to be peaceful. Any species with the capability of contacting Earth will be thousands of years more advanced than us and could destroy us with ease. Number 3. Pole Reversal Scientists understand that Earth's magnetic fields have switched throughout its existence, which wasn't a big deal when no life was on this planet. It happens from shifting liquid iron in the Earth's core. But now that our Earth is heavily populated, geomagnetic flips would usher in a doomsday. Geographic north and south would remain the same, but this would have catastrophic effects. This does happen naturally every 250,000 years. The pole reversals would let cosmic rays freely penetrate our atmosphere and cause mutations. Even just a small change in our magnetic field can cause a miniature ice age. Many electronics we're familiar with today use magnets inside of them, which would be completely thrown off. Scientists are beginning to believe that there are signs of a magnetic pole switch, and we're much overdue for one. The last one happened 780,000 years ago. Number 2. Death of the Sun This one will, without a doubt, happen. You may not be here to witness it, because it's supposed to happen every few billion years. But who knows? Just imagine if the biggest light source was just flipped to off and was the source of our demise. This star will begin to expand, as stars tend to do towards the end of their life. First, Mercury will be swallowed up, and then Venus. Then, we'll be patiently waiting our turn. The Sun will run out of hydrogen in its core. Eventually, the surface of the Sun will expand outwards like we see in this photo. Some believe this will cause the Earth to move forward in its orbit, while others believe that inevitably, it will be consumed by the Sun. Our oceans will be completely evaporated and leave us with no water on the planet. Here in this photo, you see the sizzling remains of a dead star, and you can tell the things around it aren't doing too good. And number one, Galaxy Collision. This is already starting to sound pretty epic, but it seems to be fairly certain to happen at some point. As you know, galaxies certainly aren't stationary, and these clusters of stars are held together by a gravitational pull. They're also moving at about 10% the speed of light. So what if our galaxy, the Milky Way, collides with another galaxy, certain doom? The Andromeda Galaxy, the one right next to us, will collide into the Milky Way at some point in time. As the galaxies collide, planets, stars, moods, asteroids will all be smashed together. And you thought crashing your car was bad. This would be of epic proportions. Much gravitational pull of our galaxies would be lost, sending stars all throughout the universe, making them rogue stars in the process. It would be absolute chaos for our galaxy.